Hi everyone, in today's topic we talk about Korean netizens responding to criticisms of Jenny's recent wedding guest attire. This is Omic News, short, informative and always up to date. We provide you with the newest K-pop and Korean related news every day, so make sure to hit the subscribe button for the latest infos and trends. Thank you DGOD Din Hasty Clothing for sponsoring this video. If you are interested in a free giveaway, stay tuned until the end for more details. Let's get it started and dive into it. Korean netizens are responding to a series of foreign comments about Blackpink Jennie's recent wedding guest look, sparking discussion on cultural differences in wedding attire. In an online forum, netizens shared several auto-translated foreign comments reacting to Jennie's recent photos as a wedding guest, including statements like, Korean wedding culture is so insane, everybody looks like they're going to the office. If we saw people dressed like that at a wedding, we'd think someone died. Casual dress at a wedding? That's an instant no-go. Many K-netizens were taken aback by the reactions criticizing Korea's wedding culture, where neat, semi-casual outfits in black or black and white tones are often the norm for guests. The forum user who shared these comments added I guess this is what you'd call cultural differences? Isn't it polite to dress in black and white so as not to stand out more than the bride and groom? I'm shocked that it's being compared to a funeral. K netizens noted that, in South Korea, guests typically wear muted tones or black and white as a gesture of respect toward the bride and groom, particularly to avoid competing with the bride's look. Although this tradition of avoiding white isn't unique to Korea, K netizens were surprised to see such strong reactions criticizing Jenny's outfit, which she wore to a friend's wedding. Most Korean netizens pushed back on the criticism, arguing that while all black might seem somber, Jenny's outfit looked formal, not casual, and that foreign cultures should respect South Korean customs. Some K netizens partially agreed, though, remarking that the preference for dark attire among guests sometimes makes weddings feel too somber, as many guests wear black to avoid attention. Moreover, some commented that even in Korea, wearing all black to a wedding is less encouraged and that holding such Western-style weddings is not traditional Korean culture to begin with. What do you think about these news? Please let us know in the comments. This video was sponsored by DGOD Din Hasty Clothing. Grab their limited free shirts giveaway by simply following them on Instagram at DGOD Clothing and comment on the shirt you like. Subscribe and turn on notifications for your daily doses of the latest K-pop and Korean related news. Thanks for watching and have a great day.